So I'm doing this. Ow. Mother. Adventure time, and I'm gonna embroider these jeans or try to. We'll see how that goes. I don't know how I feel about this. little update so I just did all of these but I kind of want to fill in this gap and this gap with maybe this but I don't want to ruin this so far Got to figure out a way to sell these stickers. Good morning. I need a mic. Thank you to Epidemic Sound for sponsoring this section of the video. I have been using them for a huge, huge, long amount of time. Probably like maybe two years since I started YouTube. They have been a great source of me like continuing to make videos because to me, music is almost everything when it comes to making these videos. So I have a huge amount of gratitude towards them. But enough about me, more about them. They have this huge selection of both sound effects and music to choose from. Way too many for me that I'll ever get through. Their homepage is my favorite feature. You can just log in and right there will be a couple song selections catered to you based on what you like, what you've downloaded. There's also a chance for you to become a ambassador as well. What does that mean? It means you can have a chance to getting discounts as well as paid opportunities to work with them. And that comes with not a price, but you referring at least 12 people to use Epidemic Sound. So if you do want to give them a go first, I'll have a link down below for a 30 day free trial. And what else did I want to say? One of the questions that I had when I was first starting out was if I use this music now and I end my subscription or trial with them, will I start getting charged or copyrighted? The answer is no. If you've already used their songs and you've published them, they are safe for life. So don't worry too much about that. And yeah, thank you to Epidemic Sound again and happy video making to you, whether it be Twitch, Insta, Reels, TikTok, or YouTube. The world is your oyster. The opportunities are endless. So happy creating and let's continue with the rest of the video of my very mundane life. Good morning! It's my exam day, so got my paper, computer, and pen. Here we go. I mean, she's throwing suicidal thoughts. No. Yeah, she's telling us she's having putting herself quite often for uh, for her evaluation in this case, only because I am tired. 
let me tell you guys. Yesterday we had a talk from the school and this lady was like, I am very concerned for you guys. And she said it maybe at least three times. So I feel like maybe I should go into isolation and start studying again. Oh no, I need to change the battery. Ah. All right, figure this out. I got way too many prints, so I'm thinking of just making a print bundle, as they may call it. Good morning. It's Let me shut Frank. this down. It's abusive. <gasps> it's time. Am I right? You're going? With uh, with Kevin. He's not. No, Kevin doesn't like other dogs. Well, I know. I don't think it's. it's I got disrupted by a FaceTime call earlier, but good morning. It is shop update day. I don't even remember the last time I did a shop update, but hopefully this is a okay one. I did run out of spots for products because I didn't want to pay extra money. So I had to lump quite a few products together, which I hope will be okay. But who knows, maybe it'll be a flop and I should separate all the products, but we'll see. Hari kejadian hari yang biasa saja. Jadi ada beberapa tebal memang yang sudah terisi. Lalu diangkat oleh runner. and also their morning wraps and also five donut holes because yeah they're so good i think they're better than tim hortons too and the morning wraps i've only tried it with egg and cheese but it's so good today is october 6. i just closed my p.o box i have almost a month left before i move back almost my time and the weather's getting really cool now so that's nice <sighs> Can't wait. hi yeah yes okay thank you thank you oh thank you Hi, 
just realized I didn't order my five glazed donut holes. They didn't get it. They didn't hear me. But whatever. I'm just gonna go. Oh my goodness. It's recording. It hasn't recorded for a long time directly on photo booth, which was why you guys were staring at my computer background this entire time. Anyways, hi. So I was just watching Katie's studio vlog and then I was watching Megan's studio vlog and I was like, I haven't talked in a long time. Reason being, I somehow went back to hating my voice and every time I tried talking, and I listened to it, I ended, I just ended up cutting it out. So we're gonna try here, I'm gonna record this, and we're gonna see where it goes. Plus, this video is also on the quieter, not the quieter side, but the shorter side, so might as well add a little something. Where's my life going? It's October 24. Tomorrow is my last day of rotations ever, which is honestly so, so shocking. If you've been here for a while, then you've witnessed me pre-PA school, start PA school, slightly survive school, go on to rotations, and now you're finishing it with me. Also, I realize I take a lot of breaths when I do these talking segments, and then I really zoom in on every little section of breathing, and I try to cut it out. But I almost seem like I'm breathing way too much to the point where it's like, am I a smoker or something? I'm not a smoker, but it feels like it when I'm editing these videos. <gasps> okay, anyways, what was I saying? We were talking? We were talking about rotation. Oh, I know. During my last rotation, I was at a rheumatology office and one of the patients, it was like constructive criticism almost, or maybe like a joke, but I noticed that I do this thing when I'm asking questions. I'll be like, so are we feeling better? Or something, something, we, and she was like, we are not. Basically, she goes on to saying that I shouldn't be saying we, and I was like wondering where I picked that up from, and I think it's probably from talking to the camera, because I'm thinking of like a we instead of just a me and a you, but I honestly, I don't pick it up, so I don't really know if I'm doing that, but I might be subconsciously. Speaking of finishing rotations, I also feel like by this point, I would have felt much more confident in how I'm doing, but I'm not. But I also feel like a lot of people tell me they don't feel like they're ready to be out in the wild after school, so maybe I'm in the right direction, maybe I'm not. I'm also doing Peachtober right now, which is, I don't know why I'm talking to you guys, because I should be finishing the prompt today. And I didn't know I would start Peachtober, actually. I started on the 1st of October, and I've been going daily since. There were some days where I was drawing like one and a half prompts to like try and be ahead, but I've been taking it day by day. And now I feel like I'm at the point of no return, so my prompts are probably getting really bad to the point where I might just archive them later on, but I might not, because I honestly, I should be studying. That's the biggest problem right now, but I feel like once I set my mind onto something, I can become very attached. So maybe, oh my goodness, how'd that happen? Maybe it's like a addiction kind of thing. I am addicted right now to Peachtober. So today we have the wand as a prompt. Here's my wand sketch, Sailor Moon-esque. Um, she could be better, but I feel like I spent a lot of time on the sketch already, so I have to go forward. But anyways, so for the past month, I really thought I would study and I, I do try to study, but I've definitely been giving this a lot more time. So right now my routine is rotation, which usually lasts eight to three. And then I come home, probably eat, draw, shower, draw. And that's about it, which is really bad. But I did put myself on a no drama watch, although I'm still watching like background shows, things that I won't get too attached to. I'll still allow myself to watch those. And 
I think that's all for my update. I'm moving back home in about two weeks, which I said earlier in the vlog. Also, I'm probably gonna have a sale soon, but dependent on when this goes up, please. We are down to the last bits of these Rizzo washi tapes. Please, if anyone needs washi tape that's really cheap, please buy them. Because I really don't want to lug these back home. Oh my gosh. Does it- wait. Did you guys know that's an update? You can do that on FaceTime too. It's so weird. Can you do a heart? Okay, I guess not. What else is new in my life? Nothing much. I'm doing the things that I'm not supposed to be doing, so don't be like me is the lesson. And my goal is to take the boards next year in January. And if, if, if I don't pass, I'm just gonna drop myself off the internet. But we're not gonna think about that, cause... Yeah. I feel like I went on a really weird tangent in 500 different places. But I feel like that's how my mind works. And, uh, I guess I'll just live with it. Okay, take care. Have a good rest of your October. Be safe and healthy. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye!